я периодически раз Periodically, like five times in my entire life, I become aware that instead of sleeping, I am walking around my apartment outside my physical body. I don't notice right away that it's not an ordinary reality because everything is just too real. There is no feeling that it is a dream. Just walk around the apartment. I try to trust myself, for example, to touch an object, and if I'm able to, that means that I'm not dreaming. What is the name of this state? This state is called etheric projection. This is what we do in our first main course. We must the skills of being able to control our etheric body as we would control the physical one. It is just that the etheric body has more abilities. It can transcend dense spaces, which the physical body cannot do, due to its classification and considering the elementary laws of physics of the human world, which do not apply to the etheric body. Therefore, the etheric body can transcend spaces and travel through space, but not through time. It will require the water element to travel through time, so for that you will need to connect the astral body as well. Thus the astral body can travel through time, but the etheric body can only travel through physical space, that is, our three-dimensional reality, but at any distance and through any barriers. It's like living in a parallel world, yes. And these effects, some call them phases. What are they called correctly? I told you what they're called. You should, dear colleague, necessarily cultivate this sense you have, because such a natural gift is quite rare. Everyone else must specifically work to develop it. And the rigid, dense, physical body, which is so used to feeling this way, and this way only, rarely allows you to do this. Therefore, one must master special techniques and additional methods to make the etheric body a little freer. If you have this natural ability, take care of it, cultivate it, and in no case be afraid of it. And you can actually call this ability whatever you like. In our tradition it is called etheric projection, but there are many, many other names. Choose your own and let it be only yours. Do not give it to anyone. Call it whatever you want. The most important thing is not to lose it, because this is your own natural magical tool. And there are all sorts of responsible citizens out there who are seriously on a hunt for magical tools, especially natural ones. Therefore, I wish no one would take this gift away from you. And who can take it from you? Someone who will force you to be ashamed of it, be afraid, or make you wish to sincerely get rid of it. Don't fall for these three items, all right? And everything will be fine.